All right, and good Saturday, everybody. Hope you're enjoying your Easter weekend so far. Overall, as we start off this Saturday, we ended up mostly cloudy, but we're starting to see some sunshine pop up across our area, and that will actually lead to a sea breeze. Yeah, as we go into the afternoon, and the best chance of showers and storms will be along that sea breeze across our inland areas, and some of those storms could be strong again, mainly inland. A few of those storms could push back towards the coast for tonight. Now, Monday and Tuesday, the rain chance will actually continue or even increase compared to, say, tomorrow, actually. Yeah, uh, trends are for Sunday. The rain chance, again, is going to be inland. That's the best chance and actually a little bit lighter uh, compared to today and possibly increase Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday, there's also still a rain chance and a possible decrease in that rain chance by around, say, Thursday and Friday of next week before a front approaches our area and we stay rather warm and humid. Local models showing off the best chance of showers and storms again in and along that sea breeze. A few of those could push back towards the coast for Sunday. We're looking at a lot of clouds around the area and again a few showers popping up. Uh, mainly inland for your Sunday. A lot of shower activity across the Gulf of Mexico still. Some of those could push back into our area sometime on Monday morning uh, for a good rain chance on Monday and a few more showers pushing throughout the day on Monday. Moisture content again, it will be there. Moist air will stay in our neck of the woods all the way through next week. And again, even Thursday, it's still rather moist, but there will be a front towards our north and that looks to be where the concentration of all the rain chance will be, say around Thursday and Friday of next week before it slowly moves into our neck of the woods, possibly at least at the trend right now into next weekend in the upper levels here. Not looking at much of an influence from a trough going into next week. Again, we stay warm and humid with clouds and a chance of showers just about each and every day. Now, by the end of next week, again, with that front moving through ever so slightly again, Everything will change here later on, but watching this possible trough digging down the center half of the United States could swing just enough towards the east to bring us a slight cool down by the end of next weekend. Again, next weekend we're talking about that's a ways away and that will likely change. So hopefully we can get a nice cool air mass by the end of next week and we'll have to watch that closely. Temperatures for today with the sunshine will rebound in the low 80s right along the coastline to even upper 80s inland and that will get those storms going as we go throughout this afternoon and evening. Temperatures for tonight, it's going to be humid. Near 70 or low 70s, while right on the coastline, it's going to feel very sticky. And you have the upper 60s across our inland areas, maybe a few showers still lingering around. The marine forecast caution flag is out there just because of the showers and storms that are currently out in the Gulf of Mexico may influence our coastal waters. Light shop out there, so good water conditions. It's just those showers and storms that could be around. Same thing for the beaches. Sunset will be at 745. Seas one to two feet, surf one to two feet, and we could see a few showers push back towards the coast for this evening. The 70 forecast. There's that rain chance all the way through Wednesday. Again, a slight increase Monday and Tuesday. It may be a little bit higher or watching the, the few trends on the models on the latest runs. Temperatures otherwise look to remain in the 80s. A slight decrease in rain chance by Thursday and Friday as the front remains towards our north. Low is more importantly still very humid in the upper 60s to low 70s. Another web weather updates coming up later on today.